of mystery with one, two, three, four, five red cards and one, two, three, four, five black cards. And these cards are kind of interesting, you see, um, because we mix them together like this, a state of chaos in wait, reds and black mixed together. You can mix cards in many, many different ways. I mean, you could mix them like this, drop in one or two there, two or three there, mix them like that. Or you can even do the old Vegas wash in the cards, mixing them around like that. There's another way of mixing, it's called the randomizer mix. Uh, Edition, who uh, is a mathematician as well, invented, and it, uh, it goes like this: you can give a single card, or you can mix a pair, you can swap a pair, deal single cards. It's a very, very thorough and fair way of mixing cards. In fact, Peter, we'll uh, we'll get you to mix them uh, at your end. You verbally will tell me what you want me to do: deal a single or mix a pair. Uh, mix a pair, please. Yeah, down they go. What do you want me to do now? Uh, mix a pair. Mix a pair. Clearly mixing the cards. Mix a pair. There, one more time. Up to you. Uh, I'm going to go single. Single. Now I'm going to mix a pair. Three cards left. Now there's only one card left, so that will naturally go on top, covering everything. Yeah? Perfect. Perfect. Absolutely. So three minutes ago, Peter, everybody, we uh, had a situation of five red cards and five blacks separated from each other by various means. The cards have been mixed this way and that way, that way and this way. It's a complete chaotic mess red and black clearly mixed but watch very carefully because it's like oil and water you see red and black cards but just cast a shadow over the cards like this see that the black cards have magically mysteriously and hopefully entertainingly separated on the one three four five that is ten card oil and water <laughs> 